eukaryotic cells use different RNA polymerases to make different RNAs, and then process their transcripts in several ways. This slide summarizes the complex steps of transcription initiation at eukaryotic promoters. Most eukaryotic promoters include something called a TATA box with a sequence TATAAA, very similar to the PRIBNO box in E. coli. We say the promoter is upstream of the transcription start site, by convention to the left of the transcription start site. If you were quick, you saw that the first protein to bind the promoter in this animation is called transcription factor TF2D. This starts a sequence of protein bindings, bringing other transcription initiation factors to the promoter in a specific order. One of the last proteins to add is RNA polymerase II, the polymerase responsible for messenger RNA transcription in eukaryotes. The last step in initiation is a phosphorylation event. The carboxyl end of RNA polymerase II gets those phosphates and becomes active. The activated polymerase can begin new RNA strand transcription. Eukaryotic mRNAs are elongated until PUL2, RNA polymerase II, reaches a termination signal. The characteristics of termination signals in eukaryotes are not as well understood as they are for E. coli. 